It's the 200th anniversary of the publication of Pride and Prejudice, and I'm here at the former home of Jane Austen. But now, it is time to venture forth to Alton in search of delicious wines to pair with this morning's recipes. Now, where is Mr Darcy? Gennaro's garlic and rosemary scented chicken with crunchy bruschetta would work equally well with a good bottle of white or red wine. Now if you're in the mood for a red, given the Mediterranean feel of the dish, why not try La Rectory, which is a Southern Rhone blend of juicy Grenache with peppery syrah. But this is, after all, one of the great Gennaro Cantaldo's recipes, and so I'm going to stay Italian today, and I'm going to choose a white wine from the sunny vineyards of Campania. It's the delicious Triade, which is fragrant and refreshing and full-flavoured enough for Gennaro's garlicky chicken. Although we're all familiar with Pinot Grigio, Italy's vineyards are full of thousands of different indigenous grape varieties. And this particular wine is a flavoursome blend of Fiano, Falangina and Greco. So the next time you're out shopping for wine, see if you can find an Italian grape variety you've never heard of before and just give it a go. Mmm, that's very yellow fruited. It smells of ripe apricots and orange fleshed melon. Mm. Now, with a chicken dish like this, we don't want to overpower its simple, straightforward flavours. And so a rounded, fruity, mid-weight wine like this is perfect. The ripe, peachy fruitiness of the wine will work really well with the savoury tang of the garlic. And then there are some herb and spice notes that will pick up on the fresh rosemary. Gennaro, once again, you've given us a delightful dish that would bring a smile to anyone's face as will this sunny and decidedly friendly Italian white.